Hello everyone and thanks for hanging out with me. Today I want to talk to you about the First Movers Club Facebook group because a lot of people in there are disappointed how it's all going and that they don't get the response or that um, uh, when they have a suggestion it's not in the latest update or anything and before I say this um, I totally understand why people are mad when it comes to the ID3. I also think uh, it's it for the deepest fog and he's driving without lights. It's the second one I've seen. Idiots. Um, I know a few people working for the Facebook group and I want to talk to you what's going on behind the scenes, why Facebook and all of this because I talk to them a lot and I I really think it's a bit unfair how people are treating the group and uh, I understand what they expect but that's just something that Volkswagen can't deliver it's not working that way but again I totally understand why people are mad when it comes to the ID3 there's been a lot of problems that uh, ID3 is experiencing and and I th I am the same opinion. I think it's a bit unfair to the customer and uh, Volkswagen should have said to the first movers the software you're getting is better beta. You will experience problems, big problems. I think that should have been fair. We should all knew it that uh, 10 countries got the three months lease for free or winter tires for free that it it's not just two features missing <laughs> but again they should have just said it and, and I really mean front uh, uh, say that right away not in the small print or whatever but again um, I love the car you know that all but that's not <laughs> that's not what we're talking today so people in uh, the, the in, in the group first of all why why Facebook and um, I'm just repeating what they told me and I believe them they're really really nice people and they're not just all 60 year old people a lot of young people trying to get Volkswagen to be more oriented to to younger people because the, the normal golf buyer is 55 years old <laughs> in, uh, uh, in average and I thought, uh, and, and, and I think you, you should know what the people are doing behind the scenes and, and I have a lot of talks with them and, and again, I think it's a bit unfair. Facebook was decided because there was an idea with doing the group when they got to know, okay, the software will not be finished in September, but of course they want to sell ID3s in 2020 so there's no EU fines with CO2 and whatever uh, you all know uh, uh, what 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 Volkswagen did with the ID3 and now with the ID4 as well trying to to sell as many electric cars as possible to not pay as much EU fine for CO2 emissions in average in their fleet and so when this was apparent that this will happen, that cars will be delivered with not the full functionality, they of course thought what can we do and how can we improve the car and see how the customer service, uh, just get in contact with, with, the, with the customers. And then it was okay, let's do a first movers club until the idea was okay, yes, we're doing this till it had to start was 10 weeks. And in a, in a company, a big, big company like Volkswagen, where everything has to go through a lot of channels. I mean, law, products, then uh, they have to uh, up, uh, up, not apply. You know, there's rules from, from, the, from different governments in different countries, what they have to uh, apply. I don't know the word. You know what I mean. I just have to do, <laughs> say like that. And so 10 weeks for a company like this to build up a new, uh, an own website or a forum for themselves and it, it's just not enough time. It's just no way. If you are a, 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 a private person or a small company, that's no problem. But for a company like Volkswagen, like you have to oblige. Is that the word? <laughs> uh, by a lot of rules and a lot of things. I mean, look, every, every picture you see of the ID3, it always says the cons uh, average consumption, the WLTP consumption on the bottom. 
that's a, that's one of the rules you have to do. You can never post a picture without that. Something like this. It's like what the hell? And and there's so much more. Like I said, law, product, and that everything is okay. It goes through a lot of channels, and everything has to be f uh, right. It's not easy, and and so it was not possible to do that in 10 weeks and on top of that it's also money it costs a fortune for a company like Volkswagen to have a, a forum or something like this that's presentable that uh, uh, does uh, all the rules that they need for their, for inside the, the Volkswagen and then outside for the different countries um, and so they chose Facebook Facebook group and it, the good thing about this is, of course, that you have uh, a translation that all of Europe, everybody can, can, can uh, write in their own language and then a translation underneath from Facebook. That's pretty good. That's nice. But of course, the downside of it is that there's no real order. You can pin something on top and, and stuff like this if you want to talk to everyone, but still, and, and, and have a bit of, of, of categories, but it's very hard. And so, so what you get on Facebook is <coughs> sorry <coughs> well, <I'm> dying <coughs> is a lot of double comments so people are experienced this then it's been talked about and then 10 minutes later it's another the, the same thing and if the feed is different for everyone because facebook decides what your feed looks like what you're interested in then you don't see the other one and that's just the bad side of it and that's what people are uh, annoyed of and I totally understand it <clears throat> the other thing is when you have a problem and you post it every answer that Volkswagen the, the, the people that are, are there for the for the Facebook group every answer they have to to send they want to send it has to be approved by a lot of channels in Volkswagen again law and so on and so of course they try to use answers or, or replies that are already approved. That's why you see a lot of the same replies that we have. We are sorry you you are experiencing problems with the ID3. We we are forwarding this to our developer. Blah blah blah. Totally understandable. And but what you also have to know is what other manufacturer opens an open group for their customers. That of course is not staying in there. It's being because of YouTube and, and other members and people are saying everywhere that they're openly showing the problem with their cars. Uh, I'm not naming other, other uh, companies that are not doing this. I'm just saying uh, um, there's no, none anyways. Uh, to do that, it's very risky. <laughs> you, you're potentially putting 30,000 people that had the, 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 the first edition or 15,000 as first movers or I don't know how much it was many it was I think it's three or four thousand people now in the group but they are saying what's what's not working with their car because what do you get in a group like that you get the people that have big problems you have the people that are annoyed by something I don't have my car or my WeCharge card doesn't work and then you get some that are very happy in the middle that's totally fine it's not even in there they don't care or they're not replying or they're not they're just reading but but when you just see the thing you see of course a lot of problems because the one who have problems they post the one who don't have problems most of them don't post I'm not saying there are no problems of course there are problems with the ID3 I'm just saying this then you get a, a, a weird feeling that that the car is just broken all the time and and uh, it's not working at all I'm just saying um, and this gets the mood, of course, for the group, and that's that's a bit negative. And then people are complaining that it takes time. Um, and also, but what what they told me, and what you have to think is, every time somebody is posting something, an error or a suggestion or whatever, it's being noted. Really, it's being noted. And every week, every week, there's a there's a meeting. Of course, everybody's in home office, so they're meeting with. Teams or, or Cisco Webex, or what the name is, they're meeting and then uh, uh, talking about the suggestion. Was this already suggested? Yes. Um, uh, is the problem known? What can we do? Then they go to the developer. They go to the single uh, instance uh, the development part of the car. Talk to them, and the development 
uh, uh, engineers are amazingly happy to get that. The reason is normally when, they, when Volkswagen puts out a car and there's minor issues or, or whatever, then they don't even get to know about it. It takes a long time unless the car has to be towed. If it doesn't drive at all, then there's a red flag and then the dealer has to contact Volkswagen and everything else. But if it's something small, it's not always gets to the developer. It maybe gets to Volkswagen, but the developer has a team has no idea of that. And now they're getting everything. They get suggestions, they get tiny errors, and they can go and work on it right away. It's way faster than before and it's good. But uh, if you have a suggestion or problem, also think of that. It's not possible for them to you say today, hey, but this this doesn't work. It's not possible that they, they a day later they go to the development team, say, hey, this has to be changed, and then they do the right for two days, and then it's done. It doesn't work like that. Software doesn't work like that. It has to be decided. Do we want it in the car? Is how is or how is the error? Uh, being fixed, how can we do that? Does it apply to anything else? Is it structural problem? Is it just uh, a software problem? What is it? Has to be looked at, and then it's okay. This has to be worked on, and then but there are other things. This has to be worked on this, and then everything has to be done and done and done. So this takes time till it's implemented in the software. When the software is, when it's even decided that it will be in the software, then it has to be. Uh, tested on 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 uh, uh, testing vehicles and seeing what what's happening and all of this it takes just takes time. Again, I know that that ID3 has problems and it's in my opinion wasn't always nice from Volkswagen how they did it. 12 volt battery problem and and other errors. Um, not just because it's affecting me. Overall, it's, it's just happened so many times, it wasn't single cars. So it was a, a, a main problem there. It, it shouldn't have happened. But you also have to cut the Facebook group uh, uh, people a bit of slack. And like I said, they have that meeting uh, every week and then they go to the developer and tell them what uh, people are experiencing. The developers are so happy to, see, to get that uh, uh, insight of everything. And, and I think it can, can bring Volkswagen towards better cars. They won't do that forever. I don't think it's coming for the ID4. And in, in the group, they always said for, for the ID3 that this will only continue till everybody has the, the 2.1 ME software, where it's then called ID software, not this anymore. Um, and so I really think you should uh, be a bit thinking a bit more about the people behind it. It's 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 just not possible that you send something and then a sec a minute minute later a develop or a day later a developer is telling you how this w could work and why they can do this. It just doesn't work that way in a company like Volkswagen that's this big. Even if they know and they want to say it, there's still people behind it that may say no, you cannot say that because of this, 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 and this, and this or you, uh, uh, um, you can say for this country it's different, we have to see how this works. I have a lot to do with Volkswagen and I see how it all works to, to get something approved and, and even people in Volkswagen if they want something approved, it's not easy. So <laughs> even that the Facebook group even started uh, a day before almost it did not happen. <laughs> it's uh, amazing stories that I've heard. And I really think they're doing, they're doing something great, that they're even trying this. And I think they're getting a lot out of that. And we are getting a lot out of that too. And you just have to be patient. It just doesn't work that way. I hope I could shed a bit of light on the whole issue. And I'm sorry if you're not uh, happy with your ID3, if you're not. Even with the arrows, I am happy, but everybody's different. I totally understand if you're not for whatever reason, and and you can, may have different different problems that I have that are even worse. Or I mean, I waited two weeks for a part in a company like Volkswagen, you know, biggest company, a, a car manufacturer in the world, wait for a part for two weeks. I don't know. <laughs> Should not happen. But I think that's it for me. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day and take care.
Bye.